I'll always remember the first time I saw a spittle bug mass. I had no idea what it was and I was really fascinated and wanted to learn all about them. Spittle bugs are a small insect in the spittle bug family. Nicknames are cuckoo, spit bug, snake spit, and frog spit. They get their name from the white, foamy, frothy, soap bubble like wet spittle they produce to protect themselves and their eggs. The spittle bug froth is produced by the insect's specialized glands which serve as insulation and camouflage. Spittlebugs have three life stages, eggs, nymphs, and adults. Spring and summer you can find the spittle masses on plants. The masses are three quarters inches. Spittlebugs feed on grasses and herbaceous plants. They like up to 400 host plants. Example, bed straw, roses, clover, and strawberries. Spittlebugs have a symbiotic relationship with certain species of bacteria and they help digest plant sap. There are about 60 species of spittlebugs in North America. The most common is the meadow spittlebug. Spittlebug nymphs are inside the spittlebug masses. The nymphs are soft and have elongated bodies up to one quarter inch long. They change from orange to yellow to green as they grow. Nymphs have large red eyes. Spittlebug nymphs are out late April to early May and start feeding on plants. Spittlebug nymphs pump bubbles into fluid that is secreted as a foamy substance during feedings. Nymphs feed on plant sap by piercing the plant with its mouth parts. Spittlebugs can cause damage to crops and are considered a pest. Nymphs mature at six to eight weeks. The adults move to nearby grassy areas, pastures, or areas with broad leaf weeds. Spittlebugs can jump up to 100 times their body length. They have enlarged hard legs for jumping, similar to the leaf hopper but fatter. Spittlebugs are not harmful to humans or pets. They do not bite or sting. Spittlebugs have six legs and two antennas. The adults are one quarter inch long and are hardly seen. They start out green and turn brown to gray. Adult spittlebugs are called meadow frog hoppers. The female spittlebugs return September to October to lay clusters of eggs in the plant debris, leaves, and stems. Spittlebug eggs live through the winter in the leaf litter. The eggs are white. Spittlebugs are an important part of many ecosystems, providing food for birds and other predators. Spittlebugs are non-native, introduced species to North America. I hope you have a chance to get out to see the spittlebug masses. Thanks for watching. Peace, love, and joy. Always be humble. Always be kind. See you next time.